Hey everyone, Case here. Welcome back to the Halloween update for 2020. There's a giant pumpkin! If that doesn't get you in the Halloween spirit, I don't know what does. This is also the second week, and in the second week there is a free character to go for. It's been pretty grindy. Make that really grindy. It's all with the vampires. These guys right here. I was so sick of looking at you because they've got 12 health but then there's only one character that can really do it unless you buy the premium character so it's just been stiff man and if I can't crit them it's only four attack every time so it would take three battles to get the vampire down the thing is they can usually one shot you so when it's all said and done you're looking at 21 hours sometimes to take down a vampire and there's just been too many vampires to take down on the bright note it is not only two bats instead of three, so they did a, a hot fix for that. Blah. Well, actually, first of all, let me show you where I'm at. Everything is absolutely complete. Except for one more of the candy coated popcorn. It's going to be 18 clams, and I'm going to skip it. I've had enough. Repelling sex is my superpower. Jock Neal. Oh yeah, you need the Jock Neal character in order to actually use this costume. Two more to go. Feline Ruth, which is available in the mystery box for the second week, and then Stewie, I guess, next week. I time jumped two years, and I'm still a boy virgin. I was supposed to be boy man. You're really bad at coming up with superhero names. That's because I'm too busy thinking about trying to get laid. What's wrong with boy man? Everything. Speaking of Jock Neal. There's supposed to be a parody of Jughead Jones from Riverdale. Oh no, my body's caught in endless time jumps. I'm 26 and still a virgin. It's hard to lose your virginity, man. We should make a pact to not lose our virginity until for sure it's the right time. Like, we're 100% sure it's not icky and we don't have a headache and we're caught up on our TV. Fix the table. What a weird, what a weird quest. It's a one hour quest. We've also got Look At Magazine Centerfall, which is four hours. Play Handheld Console. Rage Quit a Video Game. Spy Neighbors. And Buy Blow Up Doll. Which apparently is a chicken. Of course, it would have to be Neil that does that. Or Quagmire. Main quest line, I have to do the magazine, but I don't want to do that. So we got the table here, and we've got Kleenex and Lotion. I thought he could use an actual hammer and try to fix a table. Either way, that's not what I was really expecting. I guess when they say fix table, they mean... Decorate it? Oh, what was the quest? Hold on. Oh, remove all the tissues. And I saw the hammer, and that's what threw me off. Uh, what else I gotta do? Defeat the bat bucket. And yeah, this is the same as last week, except that they have more health. Last week was 4 health, this week is 8 health, but they still don't have any attack power, which I'm really, really confused about. So I'll probably put both characters on this, obviously, because I only have 8 tickets. And to get the tickets, you gotta buy Clear the Vampires. So that is basically it for the second week. But in the third week, there will be Stewie. And it's going to be called Baby Booster. So I'll see you very shortly with the third and final week. And then hopefully Baby Booster to wrap up the 2020 Halloween updates. So thank you very so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye everybody.